What is up guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Connor and today we're going to be trying out some Japanese candy or treats or something. I don't know. <laughs> I got this box off Amazon. It's called uh, Ninja's Treats. It says there's supposed to be 40 different kinds of treats in here that we're going to try out today. They're all from Japan apparently. And there is like an English guide and stuff too because the advertising on it is just like straight Japanese and... I don't read Japanese. You guys like my new portrayal, by the way, guys? Like, I got, like, all my G Fuel code IGL at checkout, by the way. All right, let's pop this bad boy open. I don't even know. Um, I think, is this the English guide? This is the English guide. Okay. I'm actually really excited to do this. I love, like, Japanese snacks and stuff like that. And I've been getting them mainly from World Market. But this is, like, there's, like, a whole box of different things on here. And I'm, like, pretty stoked to try these out. <laughs> this is called the uh, Naricho DIY Soft Strawberry. I think it's like uh, fake ice cream. Oh yeah, it's like a little ice cream. Look, oh God, oh God, oh God. Oh my God, it fell on the floor. You kind of see in there, there's like little ice cream cones here. Kind of cool. What is this though? There's like a powder. What the frick am I supposed to do with this powder? <laughs> okay, I think we're supposed to pour it into here like this. You can kind of see. Okay, and then do I just give it like a, one bite? Do I just give it a big, big old bite? Hmm. Okay. Interesting. Not a huge fan of that. <laughs> I'm honestly, that's, mm, that wasn't very good at all. What about just like this? What if I just try the cone out? Mm -mm. No. Cone's got a weird flavor to it. The powder has a weird flavor to it. That one's not for me, fam. I'd give that one like a, like probably like a two. Not worth the calories, honestly. <laughs> all right, up next, there's a cream cologne, cream filled biscuit cones. Let's give that a shot. Give it, give it the old snipperoo here. Yeah. Oh, actually, oh, those smell so good. Oh, that smells like a Barnes and Noble's butthole. That smells so good right now. Oh, okay. Oh, that's yummy. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. That's the kind of snacks that I need the whole time. That's what I need right there, baby. I'm, I'm just now realizing a lot of these are like ice cream. This one just says beer on it. I guess we'll try this one out. Let me see what it is. This is a uh, Raugaki beer, yellow beer-like beverage. Add to cold water and stir. Oh, uh, oh. <coughs> nope. Got that out. Nope, not doing that one. That one was not good. <laughs> nope, give me, give, me, give me a vanilla roll, please. All right, what else do we got here? Okay, let's go with these. These look like little sesame things. Baki peanuts. Let's give these guys a shot here, eh? Oh, yeah. Oh. That was just like the Japanese pub mix I used to get when I was a kid. Those are good. There's an actual peanut in here. We're going to try that out. And kind of see. Hmm. Yeah. I mean, that's good. That's a good one. I like those ones. Cocky peanuts is pretty good. I got to be careful saying that. Okay, I got a couple of these things. This is a uh, porky. We're gonna try this out and kind of see what it is. I don't, I, porky, I don't know what this is gonna do. They look like maybe corn sticks. Porky, where's the porky? <coughs> yeah, porky pretzel corn flavor. It says it contains milk, wheat, egg, chicken, and soy. Why is there chicken in this? Nope. Rash, not for me. Okay, we have another, um, another ice cream here. <coughs> It says uh, cone marshmallow, marshmallow cone on it. I think we're in for a little bit of a treat here. I think this one's a, with how small it is, I think this bad boy is just like a popper. And what I mean by that is I'm just gonna literally pop the entire thing in my mouth right now. Here we go. Okay. Interesting. To me, that has like no flavor. <laughs> nope. Next. What am I doing? <clears throat> I, I literally started this video off by saying that I really like Japanese candy. Like, there's like something in my mouth. Okay, these look cute. I don't know what these are, but we're gonna find out. All right, all right, there's a chance that these are Bisco cream cookie sandwiches, which if you ask me, I'm I'm, I'm all about that. So let's see. Oh yeah, it looks like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It looks just like a Bisco cream sandwich. Oh, there's like little mini, they're so cute. Little, little cute little mini little sandwiches look at that look how cute that is i'm gonna pop it open oh that smells delicious oh that smells tasty mm. Mm. oh yeah if, if there's any of these snacks that are good it's like the cream filled ones that's my favorite thing <coughs> okay there's like some jelly substance one right here i'm gonna suck it down i'm gonna suck it right on down oh it smells delicious we're good we're good i saved it that uh, it says it's Koniaku. That was good. Almost killed me, but it's still pretty good. <clears throat> what is this? Oh, it's a Haichu. <gasps> Look, there's a Japanese Haichu in here. Oh my gosh, zoom in. Come on, focus. 
Oh yeah, look, okay, look, there's a, it's a Japanese haichu. I love haichus. Me and Paul, fun fact. We used to eat a haichu every day. I'd eat it, I'd spit it into his mouth, he'd eat it, spit it back into mine. It was delicious. Oh man, green apple, haichu? It just take me back. Mm. Take me all the way back, baby. All right, moving on. What is this? It looks like a little pastry thing. Looks pretty cute. I like it. It has, is, is that a word on there? It says, uh, sak takete, sakwet, takwit, sakisha. It looks pretty good. Not gonna lie to you guys. Oh, it smells like a, yeah, it just smells like a straight up chocolate pastry. All right, here we go. Chocolate, chocolate pastry thing. That was weird. Like it like started off good and then it got bad and then it got good again and then it got bad again. Okay, this one is called uh, cheese, Zach. Uh, it's a crispy and creamy cheese snack. Okay. We'll give it a shot. Oh, whoa, that looks cool. Look how cool this looks. It looks so fluorescent. Look at that, it looks so cool. This is definitely gonna come out weird. I gotta give it a shot though. Okay. I'm confused. Like, is it good or is it not good? Let's give it a shot again. It's got like this weird, like all their savory stuff has like a fishy flavor to it. And I hate fish. With that being said, this next one literally has a fish on it. Let's see what this is. It's called Yaitara. There's fish all over it. I really am nervous about this. Like I said, I'm not a huge fish guy, so I don't know how this, I really don't know how this is gonna go. What is this? It's not crunchy. Uh, nope, can't do it. I need, a, I need a palate cleanser. Give me, give me the cream, please. Mm. Sakurambo mochi, cherry flavored candy made from rice cake. That sounds awesome. That sounds so much better than that last one. Let's give it a shot here. Look at, it looks so cute in there. Look at that, dude, it looks so cute in there. I love that, it's so cool. I used my toothpick and I got it on here. Looks pretty cool, I'll give it a shot. Mmm, is that mochi? Yeah, it's mochi. Okay, I'm just used to like mochi ice cream where it's like cold. Is that mochi or is that gum? That's good, I'm putting that off to the side. That's a good little snacky for later. Oh, this one's cool. It's got some kind of, it's got like a, it's like a strawberry belt or something of some sort. What, is, what does it smell like though? It smells good. It tastes pretty decent. We're just gonna pop the whole thing in my mouth. Oh yeah. Oh, that's pretty good. It tastes kind of like tamarindo. Again, it's got some fishy flavor to it. What is with the fishy flavors, bro? That one started off good and it ended really bad. Okay, this one might be a good palate cleanser, but if you look here, it's a, it's some kind of marshmallow. Hello, focus camera. There we go. Hopefully not, it's not fish flavored. That would be great. All right, um, it's really elastic. Uh, it... Oh yeah, uh, that's just like a marshmallow. But it's got a sour flavor to it. What is that? What's going on there, man? What's with the sour fishy stuff? Normally I'm really into the Japanese snacks, but I'm kind of failing me right now. Uh, what? Cola bubble gum candy? It looks like a pack of condoms. <laughs> Focus camera. Yeah, look, okay, look, it's like a full on capsule. How interesting, let's give it a shot. My mouth is foaming up. That like bubbled in my mouth. Am I supposed to put this in a drink? I think I was supposed to put that in a drink. And I just straight up ate it. Was it straight up just like bubbled in my mouth as if there was a soda in my drink or a, a drink a thing in my, so what am I even saying? <laughs> I, I really don't even, I don't even know what this is. We're going to give it a shot though. I, I'm just going to eat it. It looks, pro it looks promising. Might be gum. Oh yeah, it's gum. Oh, that's a good old palate cleanser right there. Let me tell you, after all the stuff I've eaten, I should go to palate cleanser. Okay, we have a mini bottle here. I think it says it's a Ramune flavored soda bottle. I think is what it is. I just saw it. Yeah, mini bottled Ramune bottled powder Ramune candy. That's a lot of words for a piece of candy. I'm going to be honest with you guys. You'll send it back? Oh yeah, that doesn't even taste like anything. That doesn't taste like anything at all. I don't, what am I, what am I supposed to do there? It just tastes like candy. Not a huge fan of that, to be honest with you guys. This one looks promising. It says it's a caramel cream. Okay, so this is the thing though. Is it gonna be like a dry caramel or is it gonna like wet my whistle, you know what I mean? It's a dry caramel. I want some wet caramel. Dude, I want something wet in my mouth right now. This looks really cool. It says it's sour paper. Look at how long it goes. It goes on forever. That sounds awesome. Sour paper, that's what I like to hear. Give it a shot. Let's try some sour paper. I'm down to try some sour paper. Oh yeah, dude. I love sour candy. Let's give it a shot. 
Mm, 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 mm. Okay. Mm. Oh my god, that's like really, that's like really hard to chew. My jaw might fall off. Dude, that is like so hard to eat. I feel like I'm eating rocks right now. Okay, I still have quite a few more snacks here that I'm gonna have to try. Probably in another episode if you guys like this episode enough. But we're gonna finish it off with a classic. Pikachu bubble gum. Just like a yellow colored candy. Um, bubble gum. Classic bubble gum flavor right there. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. That's a good palate cleanser right there for sure. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are interested in seeing more videos like this, I don't know, it just sounded fun to me, so I wanted to record it. But we'd love to hear your guys' feedback on this kind of content. If you guys want to see more of me trying different snacks from around the world, comment down below where you guys want to see me get some snacks from and send me some links, I guess, on Instagram to Amazon and Maybe I'll give them a shot. Videos are popping up on the screen right now, including the last time I played a game. Go check out all my links down in the description below. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.